Welcome to Quebec's Côte Nord region, a land which was first home to indigenous communities. Here, we store and generate clean energy to power us all. Take in the view of the Manicouagan Reservoir. It was filled with water in the 1960s when the imposing Daniel Johnson Dam was built. The dam is 1.3 kilometers long. With its 13 arches and 14 buttresses, it is the largest dam of its kind in the world. It's so vast that its construction required the help of 12,900 employees. Here's how we harness the power of water to generate electricity. Water from the reservoir enters the intakes, passes through the turbines of the generating stations, and runs back into the river. In this case, the same water then flows through Manic 3, Manic 2, and Manic 1 generating stations before eventually reaching the St. Lawrence River. To make sure the concrete resists weathering, we carry out inspections using drones on this side of the dam and submarines on the reservoir side. Two impressive technological innovations. This is the main arch. It is 165 meters high, as tall as a 50-story building. Have a look around. See the employees working inside the dam? They rely on over 2,000 instruments to carry out inspections and maintenance work. Of these, 200 connected devices transmit data and alerts in real time through a fiber optic network. We've been generating clean energy to power Quebec and its neighbors since the Quiet Revolution. Over 50 years ago, it was an incredible accomplishment to design and build the Manic 5 development. Today, we can take pride in knowing it will continue to ensure energy future for decades to come.